Peter Novotny from the Czech Republic, the Hanuman Jim, and uh, he's fighting in the lightweight division. And uh, he's looking forward to fight this man, Bilal El Alawi, from the Jim Alakmar, the local hero, fighting for his home crowd. Peter Novotny looks to use his technique against Bilal El Alawi, fighting in his own hometown, who will be keen to add to his KO record. Stay tuned, 8TKO.com. Well, the next 8 TKO fight is in the lightweight division. Fighting out of the blue corner representing the Czech Republic, Peter Novotny! There he comes all the way from the Czech Republic, Peter Novotny, as I said, from the renowned Hanuman Jim. Guy with the 14 fights on his record, 12 wins, only two losses, two KOs, so he knows how it is to win a fight, Julie. Exactly. He says no opponent is going to be tougher than his sparring partners. He has fast feet. He likes to put the pressure on. And he's ready for all situations. Well, that uh, promises a whole lot of good things. Because uh, a lot of different situations will definitely come his way, his way tonight when he fights uh, the hometown hero, the Lal El Awi, who is going to make his way to the ring any moment now. Here's opponent in the red corner. From Morocco, Bilal El Alawi. Well, here he comes, Bilal Al Alawi. A very good record: 24 fights, 20 wins, two losses, two draws, but 14 oh, by KO. Oh. That's a huge percentage, then. That is a huge percentage. That means he has dynamite in his fist. And that means that he is coming to knock somebody out. And he usually succeeds. So uh, let's see how he fares tonight against his uh, obviously very tough Czech opponent. But he has the crowd on his side. Like I said, he's a local boy. He's from Alkmaar. He's from the gym Alkmaar even. Uh, Jim really got a very good pedigree in the past with fights like Kaas and Drago and Dennis Tribus and you name him. Back in the days, trained by Edwin Van Hoss. Yeah, exactly. Our, our CEO. Exactly. Well, he's set through the ropes now. The gym is run by Mark. You can see just opening the ropes there. He fought many times on Infusion yep. himself. Good trainer Absolutely. here in Alkmaar. Well, the man in the blue corner from the Czech Republic. 24 years old, stands in at 181 centimeters. 14 fights on his record, 12 victories, 2 defeats. Two of his winning fights by way of knockout. He's representing Hanuman Jim. Ladies and gentlemen, your applause is for uh, Peter Novotny! <laughs> Here's opponent in the red corner from Morocco. 21 years old, stands in at 180 centimeters. 24 fights on his record, 20 victories, 2 defeats, 2 draws. 14 of his winning fights by way of knockout. He's representing Jim Alakbar, Giggs, Bilal, El Alawi. This 8th TKO fight in the lightweight division is scheduled. Three rounds of three minutes. In case of a draw, we have an extra must win round. This fight is sponsored by Say Scarf Folding and the referee is Mr. Niels Burske. This is an interesting match, Dennis. It is an interesting match. You can see also a little bit of height difference between these two gentlemen. But uh, I said this is a super fight, so there's no tournament involved, there's no second fight involved. They can put it all out in this nine minutes, or maybe 12, who knows? Or maybe free, or maybe, well, let's find out. Look at the stare of Al Alawi. Yep. I haven't seen him look like this before. He is coming off a loss. It was a very close loss. He is wound up like a spring. Oh. And he gets that left hook. Six seconds into the fight, and he's already done. He's going to go for the finish. You can see it in his eyes. Oh! Takes oh, one back. Gets clipped. You gotta be careful, he does get overzealous here. It's 
Novotny still in this fight. Novotny is tough. He's a good fighter. He will try and regain himself here. Fodding right hand from Aloui. Yeah, you know, these people from the Czech Republic they eat nails for breakfast instead of cornflakes. See the reddening on his face, though. Two very tough fighters here. Yep. Well, it's a good start to this fight. I kind of like it. It's a good start. Long push kick down the center. Looks oh. for that lift hook again, Alawi. Got to be careful, though, because he's swinging, but he's opening himself up at the same time. Oh, again with the right Mark hook, again right with hand. the right hook. This is not going to last. He's not this, Well, I'm, so, I'm sorry, lost He's for words He's not gonna here. take a lot there. No, is, I'm getting excited, Dennis. Oh, it's all going over the, over the right side, the left side of Novotny. I'd be surprised if it makes it out of the first round, to be honest. Hard left body kick back from Novotny. He's got red bruise on his face on both sides, and he's wobbling again. How many of those right hands can he take? The head is being bounced. He's still smiling, though. Seems to enjoy it. <laughs> Strong jab back. Good. Jumping uppercut there. You know, the reddening across the body yeah. and the face where Louis is... Just landing those shots. Oh, they both get uh, <laughs> a low blow. Ooh, like the double left hook. We, yeah. <laughs> we have a I double low blow. I don't know what hit each other, but... <laughs> I don't want to know. Let's hope they're both all right. I'm sure we'll get a little replay of that. Here we go. Yeah, Boom. Knee, knee on knee. Same shot, left knee. Oh. <laughs> this is one to uh, yeah look back on. I'm sure they can smile about it tomorrow, but not right now, though. So now they've just got some time to recover there. Yeah, it takes a little bit the uh, pace out of the fight, which is going really well or really exciting. But straight back at it. Right where we left off. Strong jab. Yeah. Good low kick. Good oh. push kick down the center. I like this aggressive approach by El Alawi. He put so much effort in that low kick, he really went flying with it. Good, Good knee, knee to the body, yeah. Mm. Oh, push kick sends him back almost. You know, Alawi is on fire this evening. He's really upped his game. Fud in right hand, hits around the ear. Novanti, he keeps walking forward, chopping away at the legs. Definitely come here to fight. The end of the first round. Well, we do get to see it go out of the first round, and that has all to do with the toughness of Novotny because he can take a punch, that's for sure. For sure, for sure. You know, they didn't come here to lose. He's here with his trainer. You can see Peter Machaket, very good fighters coming through this gym. Yeah, and you see. Yeah, that was the left hook in the first five seconds of the fight, sending Novotny down. Ooh. That was a beautiful shot, really beautiful. was. Beautiful, well timed. But, yeah, Novotny showed he was tough, he, he was still in this fight, still throwing his shots, but he got clipped a lot, and you know, that's it's going to add up in the second or third oh, round if, if we get that far. But, you know, uh, Alawi's not having everything his own way, you know? It's still a tough match for him. Yep. You know, also for this team, Peter, his team teammate is next. Fight for the world title or against Kian de Frez. Good combination, he comes out with Alawi, comes back with heavy shots. Yeah, but Nice, yeah. Novotny is so strong, he calls him in. And there goes that push kick right to the midsection. One back, sends him on his pants on the canvas. Yeah, and he can, you can see the difference between a non-tournament fight. This guy doesn't have to worry about fighting again, just throwing it all out here. Honestly, Novotny is so tough. Alawi hits hard. Getting a little bit of a limp, I think, also from those low kicks. The legs are not feeling too fine, I suppose. 
Steps in with that left knee. Oh, a little bit to Sheikh du Soleil. And gets right a head, head kick in return. Oh, Ooh. he's ready on wobbly legs now. Yeah, that's a standing eight count. He's taken a lot. Yeah. Deep breaths. You can see the heart in him. Good call for referee Niels Burskun to step in there and I get the eight count. I don't know if it's going to... Navati has got pure heart. Walks into a right kick. Good angling from Alawi. What swings there? I don't know what yeah, that was. Same, same. Taking the legs in. Yeah. Alawi. Look at all the bruising all over the body of Navati. His back, his arms, his head, his neck, even. His Ooh, legs. Oh, takes a nasty uppercut. Yeah. It's really only his heart that's keeping him in this fight. Yeah. You know how to say some fighters are too tough for their own good? Well, he might be just that. It was a mistake. Hard low kick. Yeah, good block no though. Oh. Right, Mikey, he needs to keep his guards in. up. Yeah. I think he's got swelling coming up on that eye anyway. Push, Push kick. kick. Yeah, using the whole arsenal here. Uh, got to keep uh, that left hand yeah. up. He's taking too much damage on that left hand side of the face, Navati. Keep your left hand up. Still trying to push forward, Aloui just dominating the shots. Dominating every, everything, to be fair. The end of the second round. And he looks fresh as a daisy still. What a great performance here from Blau Aloui. Very impressive so far, really picking his opponent apart. And like I said, the only reason he's still in this fight because he has a heart the size of Mount Everest. He really does. Look at his face just a second ago. He's willing himself to go, and he's really taken a lot of damage on that left side of the face. He's wobbled. Yeah, it was uh, the second eight count, standing eight count. Yeah. Good you call there from the ref, and, but uh, Alawi just goes straight back to work. And he mixes it up nice. He goes head, body, you know, low kicks, high kicks, push kicks. He really takes all the weapons he has to uh, and put them to use. You're Seconds not, not going to get Novotny out of there easy. No, I did not think we would see a third round in this fight, but yet here we are. Here we are. Touch gloves. Trying to come in. Good high kick from Novotny. Did still have some fight in him. Oh, a little bit wild there from Al Alawi. Good left body kick. Starting to open up. And again, taking a lot of damage. Trying to move around with his footwork, Novodny. Deep breaths, trying to edge forward. Oh, again, almost eats a head kick. Just, he keeps trying to chop the legs of Alui, but he's yeah. taking the shots. Yeah, because he leaves his guard open when he throws the kick. Yeah, so he just gets counted. Really trying to take the legs away from him, because if you chop down the roofs, it's going to take away the power of the boxing too. Yeah. That's what his game plan is. But he took a lot of luck kicks himself in the first two rounds, so. He's taking a lot of shots all over. Yeah. Faking his way in, yeah, he's still got all the tricks up his he sleeve, Navani. He went zig when he should have gone zag. <laughs> Calling him in, well, he's an entertaining fighter for sure. I do like watching Navani. Yes, he is definitely a fighter with a true fighter's heart. 
can take nothing away from him. Really enjoying the performance from Aloui as well. Yeah. Looking strong. You hear the coach. Peter speaking, shouting to Dovodny. They want to take that front leg of Alawi out. Yep. Walks oh, into a good, knee. Yeah, good knee there. Right on the arm pit. You know, if we had a trophy for Hart tonight, Novotny would be getting it. He would be the world champion of the world for Hart. <laughs> Bilal coming in with the push kick. Good left hook, right yeah, hand. See if Bilal can still maybe finish the show here. 30 seconds to go. He's been preserving his energy for the most of this third round. Maybe he has a little bit extra in the tank. Oh. Lucky that wasn't a second before. The ref is taking a very close look. I hope he makes it to the end. Last Probably turn. will. In zombie mode. Still landing, still throwing, but also still receiving. What a guy, what a heart, what a willpower. Yeah. Hats off to this young man, but yeah, there can be no doubt about who won this fight. You know, straight away showing respect there. An amazing performance. Yep. Great sportsmanship. Yeah, Bilal El Alawi looked uh, great, especially that first two rounds. He was on fire, landing great. about everything he thrown, from head kicks to low kicks, to straight punches, hooks, uppercut, body shots, the whole thing, the whole shebang, as they say, uh, as we move in some of the highlights of this fight. Great performance, but he just had, like, yeah, like I said, a zombie in front of him today. Thoroughly enjoyed it, thoroughly. Yeah, absolutely a great fight as we take a look at some of the action. This is the very beginning of the fight, after five or six seconds, to count the left hook, send the body down to the canvas, and then, yeah, the story of this fight was already set, and from then on, he just took a beating took a lot of punches, a lot of punishment from El Alawi, and that continued into the second round. Where again, he still was trying, but he got caught moving in. But his heavy hands of El Alawi, and here the good stepping by the referee, giving him the standing eight count for the second time in the fight. And Alawi goes straight back to work, landing all sorts of techniques. And in the third round, we actually saw a little resurgence of Novotny just fighting his heart and doing everything he can, maybe to get himself back in his fight, he landed like a shot. But it was not happening, it was not his day, but yeah, we can only take a heads off for the courage and the heart he's shown here in this fight. Truly warrior spirit, spirit. but yeah, the, the, the better fighter tonight was Bilal El Alawi, no doubt about it. Let's go into the ring to Tom Wesling for the official decision. Yes, of course, it was, uh, was a tough op opponent, but uh, I have to make something right because uh, my last fight two weeks ago, I lost my fight and I was so hungry, I, ca I can't sleep, I can't think anymore because I, I have to set it right. And today it is. It was not uh, a KO, but uh, I won the fight. We've seen it, we've seen the hunger in your eyes as she was walking down the catwalk and she was staring at your opponent across the ring. 
as soon as the, the first bell went, you went for it, and we just knew that you had a win on your mind, but it was a very, very tough opponent. It was, it was a uh, respect uh, to him, of course. And so, like I say, I'm young, I'm hungry, I'm ready for more. The I next year you're gonna see, I let uh, more things uh, see about me. Well, we're excited to see you again. Again, congratulations on a great performance. Enjoy the win and get some sleep now. Thank you, I wanna say something also. Pray for brothers and sisters in uh, Palestine also. Thank you. Thank you.